surging construction of major warehouse facilities in the Inland Empire cities, once thought to be an economic boon to the area, now being looked at differently. So many million square foot facilities are now in place in Colton, Riverside, Ontario, and other locations that neighbors are complaining of diesel truck pollution, noise, and road degradation from traffic. Some moratoriums on buildings were closed in the last year, but Susan Phillips, a professor of environmental analysis, College says it's not enough, and residents are growing skeptical of the trade-offs that developers are offering jobs versus clean air. It can't be an either-or situation. In order to find the solutions for the problems, we actually do need a much bigger pause, a longer pause, and we also need to think about how we concentrate these facilities in poor, low-income neighborhoods. It may fall to state lawmakers to eventually impose construction or environmental restrictions before these cities lose neighborhoods favor of industrial sites. Pete Demetrio, KNX News, 97.1 FM. More than 4 million fentanyl pills and more than 900 pounds of powder have been taken off the streets in California since April of last year. State Attorney General Rob Bonta says there have also been more than 200 arrests. He says this is all part of the battle carried out by law enforcement agencies on the streets who are working with the state. Bonta says the other front... Wall Street. DOJ is obtaining judgments to hold the industry accountable for their unabashed pill pushing. In fact, to date, we have secured over $32 million, billion with a B, through nationwide to hold the big opioid peddlers accountable and bring funding back to our state to help crisis. And Bontis has recently fentanyl has been produced in rainbow colors, potentially aimed at increasing use among young adults. The suspected serial killer has been arrested in Northern California. Update on the story coming up in three minutes. It's 835, time for a look at your traffic. Here's Tim Green. Okay, on the five southbound now uh, at Avenida Vaquero, uh, this one is where we have a two crash off to the right side in Orange County. And for the folks who uh, aren't big on that, that's not really an, oh, that's not an exit. That is uh, just south instead of Camino de los Mares. So, uh, that's where that is in San Clemente, or just south of where the one and the five merge coming out of Dana Point. Let's put it that way. So just south of where the Coast Highway and the five merge is where we have a new two-car crash on the southbound side, uh, heading out of South San, uh, Orange County. On the five northbound at Camino Las Robles, uh, looks like we have a two-car crash off to the right side there as people jump up and start to move around this Sunday. Uh, 10 westbound at Fairplex Drive, a new hazard. Somebody conked out uh, by the L.A. County Fairgrounds. 5 north at Hollywood Way above Burbank. Wooden pallets again off in the rightmost lane right now. Southbound 110 connector to the 10 east. All clear. That fatal crash has cleared, and the 10 and the 110 are back to operating exactly the way they were designed. Next traffic report, 845 in the Puente Hills Sunday, 24-hour traffic center. Highs today in the 60s and 70s, but tomorrow a little bit warmer. We'll see 70s and 80s and a warming trend continuing on through Wednesday. Right now, 63 degrees in Redondo Beach, 62 in Burbank, 62 in Garden Grove at 837. This is the time of right now. New television, 4K, 8K, ultra smart HDTVs, sound board, complete home theater, and more during the Video and Audio Center. An exciting 42nd anniversary celebration for you. Plus the biggest deals for the biggest games on TV, the big games. And much more from Video and Audio Center. Our prices are the same or more than the internet. Plus free setup details and server. Our lowest price ever. Samsung's ex- 4K Smart HD. Or take the 75 for 797. The 65 inch Samsung only 497 right now. It's here. Sony's best OLED TV is at Video and Audio Center. And right now, the 55 inch Sony OLED TV for only 13 Video Center LG OLED headquarters for only 1146. Sonos latest soundbar, a Sonos Ray for only 279. Video and Audio Center. Shop in store or call them online 310 899 2929. Are you seeing the telomeres here? Come here, look at the scope. Dr. Ocasio's lab startup just discovered a gene therapy breakthrough. The cells have already built. Needs a fleet of research assistants before this breakthrough breaks them. We need lab techs, research assistants. Indeed can help them hire great people fast. I need Indeed. Indeed you do. We instantly connect you with quality candidates whose resumes on Indeed match your job description. Visit Indeed.com slash credit and get $75 towards your first sponsored job. Terms and conditions apply.
jack-o'-lantern, and other chords are great additions to any compost pile. Join Odyssey, and together, each of us doing one thing. Tomorrow, what's your one thing? 8.39 on KNX, police in Northern California arrested a man as he was about to continue his months-long killing spree. Police arrested 43-year-old Wesley Brownlee of Stockton early Saturday morning. They believe he's the serial killer responsible for six murders that had the... The arrest happened in two parts. One was community tips, and the second was good old fashioned police work. Officers were surveilling the... ...to the arrest. When the suspect left during the late hours of Friday evening, they followed. We watched his patterns and determined he was on a mission to kill. County District Attorney scheduled an arraignment for Tuesday. David Welch for CBS News in California. Former House Speaker Paul Ryan says he does not expect former President Donald Trump to win the Republican nomination for the presidency in 2024. I think Trump's unelectability will be palpable with him. We all know that he will lose, or he's put it this way. We all know that he's so much more likely to lose the White House than anybody else running for president on our side of the aisle. So why would we want to go with that? And Ryan made this comment during a podcast with Tenio, a risk assessment company. He says the only reason that Trump stays where he is is because, in his words, everybody's afraid. Former President Barack Obama hitting the campaign trail ahead of the midterms. Obama's going to stump in several key battleground states, including Georgia, Michigan, and Wisconsin. He's going to be in Atlanta later this month where he's going to campaign for Senator Raphael Warnock. And in Milwaukee where he supports Democratic Lieutenant Governor Mandela Barnes who sent a fight with incumbent Republican Senator Johnson. Obama is also going to appear in Detroit where Governor Gretchen Whitmer holds a single-digit lead right now over her Republican challenger. Non-English speakers being targeted online with misinformation in the run-up to the election. The Vietnamese American community is particularly vulnerable. Nick Wynn, co-founder of Viet Fact Check, says small group blocking is a low priority. He calls misinformation fiction. Vietnamese Americans poll with Democrats on topics like gun control, health care, and the environment with uh, a typical sort of red-baiting strategy, which is to tie a certain He says the root of it is hyper-targeting the trauma and shared experience the community has, and the isolation of language makes them a vulnerable and inexpensive target. Art Sanders, KMX News, 97.1 FM. Where gas prices are... Yeah, new rundown coming up. It's 841. Stick a paper clip into a socket. Run a red light. Skydive with no parachute. Some accidents are your fault. For injuries that are not, find award-winning personal injury attorneys at Injured.com. When you need a powerhouse legal team, visit Injured.com today. Individual rates, coverage, offerings, and savings may vary. Subject to terms and conditions. Not available in all areas. Actual by customer. As a small business, we can offer the quality product and get some cost savings. Meet the shelf. J.J. Fister Distilling Company, a small business in California. When looking for workers' comp coverage tailored to the company's needs, she discovered Pi Insurance. We heard about Pi Insurance, the gear for small business, gave Pi a call, and ended up switching. Is your small business overpaying for workers' comp insurance? See how much you can save at TryPi.com. Plus, your premium is based on your actual payroll, which means no additional bill if your business grows. We saved about 30% off of our workers' comp insurance when we switched to Pi. It's as easy as Pi to get the savings you deserve. What are you waiting for? Ask your agent for Pi. Or get a quote in three minutes at trypie.com. That's T-R-Y-P-I-E dot com. Harvard Eye Associates in Laguna Hills is participating in a clinical trial for the improvement of new generation, or better known as AMD. To qualify, you must be 55 years or older and be unsatisfied with your current near vision correction provided by glasses or external magnifiers. There is no charge to qualify candidates and you may receive up to $1,400 for participation. Transportation will be provided to and from the clinic. To learn more, please call 842-9954. Call 949-842-9954. Take advantage of the ultimate buying experience in Bob Smith BMW with this great offer. Right now, receive a loyalty credit through the purchase of any BMW certified.